Hello everyone. Um, sorry I'm getting on here late today. It's Saturday and we had a very busy day today. Had to run to the to uh, town to the stores and, and stuff and then we come back and our power was off. Well, when our power is off, everything's gone. Uh, we don't have no phones, no internet, no nothing here where we live. It's kind of all connected in together. So, but it, I just wanted to get on here real fast this evening and show you guys. I picked up a few things today. Uh, this is a little onesie I got at uh, Walmart. It's a zero to three months. Um, I got this at Walmart today for the little baby that I'm making that I'm putting the hair in. This is hers. I got this for her. I always like to put them. I usually, on my customs, I usually put them on like a, a sleeper. And then underneath the sleeper, I put them on like a little onesie. Kind of like a little undershirt, little t-shirt. And under it. And then some socks and under it. So I got this for her today. It's uh, just a little simple little onesie. It's uh, white and it's got pink pink around the neck and around the neck, you know, trimmed out. And then it's got little um, like a mama bear and a baby bear sitting on a bench. And the, the little baby bear's got popcorn in his hand. But I got this at Walmart. It's just two dollars at Walmart. You can't beat this for you know they're nice thick little quality t-shirts i mean they're really nice and then this was the outfit i got her to put on her i got it at walmart also and it was on clearance for five dollars and it's a real soft pink a thicker sleeper uh i guess the reason they're doing that right now is probably because these are the thicker ones like for winter time but it's still cold guys i mean you know it's not like it's warm right now or anything it had been here last week uh, it had been like 80 degrees but you know that's just a fluke here because um you know, we don't have 80 degree weather in the middle of February. So, you know, that's, I don't know what happened there, but the cold weather is going to come back. But anyway, this is a, it's a real pretty pink with like little, uh, star, it's little dots all over it and they're kind of shiny, like silver shiny little dots. And it's got little bows down, two little bows down the front and then it snaps all the way at the bottom. It's got feet in it and it's got a little cat sitting on a cheeky little cat there with a little princess hat on. And I got this on clearance at Walmart for $5. That's not bad at all for that. And, um, let me see. I got this for her baby boy coming up next. I'm going to be doing a baby boy for her too. And I've got a sleeper in the uh, closet for him. And I only needed this little undershirt. And I've got socks too that I've bought different places. You know, just like a whole bag full of socks. So I got that, but he needed a uh, little one seat to go under his sleeper. I got this at Walmart also today, two dollars. It's uh, just a little white onesie with a lighter light blue trim around the neck, and it's got little bears on it, like a daddy bear and a baby bear. And uh, uh, daddy bears hung like a lantern. And then down on down here, it's like they're sitting around a campfire. You can see there, like a little campfire. The baby and daddy are roasting marshmallows. So anyway, I got that at Walmart for two bucks for that other little baby. I got my baby boy a few more things today while I was there, guys. I'm trying to get ready for him. So when I get him finished, I've got a lot of, I've got a lot of stuff planned for him. If I ever get his hair, I don't know if it's ever going to come in or not. I wish it would hurry up. But anyway, I got these. These are Parents' Choice bibs. I got them at Walmart. And one is blue, a light blue, like a uh, terry cloth. And it's got like a, 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 a slick, like, binding around it around the neck and around the outer edges and it's a pale blue and it says mommy loves me and on one side it's got a little orange fox and on the other side it's got a little raccoon and then i get two for the, on this and this one it's got the lighter blue around the edges but it's more of a white background with the uh the little raccoon and the little orange fox and some trees like green trees outlines of green trees looks like there might be an owl yeah, but right there's an owl. But these are just two little bibs, and I think they were like two. They're the parents' choice. They were two, I think it's two ninety seven for both of them. So that's good. That's a good price. This is my other ones I showed you. Dad hasn't got hung up yet. Now, I was wanting to do him a bottle, a fake bottle. And so I, I hadn't, didn't have the materials to do it with, but I'll show you this first. I got him some Nook Passies, some pacifiers. They're Nook brand, and... I'm probably going to use this bluer one right here. And you know, guys, I didn't know it, but what was so interesting, when I brought them in, the power was off. And this part of this one glows. It's like a glow-in-the-dark, iridescent type thing. 
But anyway, the pacifier part is a light blue. And then right in there, it's got like some trees over this side and it's got a bear right in the middle. And then something over there, I can't, just trees. And then on the side, it says nook. And then this is more of a, uh, like a teal green, blue green. The handle around it is, it holds it. And it's, it's close in the dark. Then we also got this one in with it. It's like a three pack. It was a gray and with a light blue ring. Uh, and it's got little bunnies on it. And I may do this one for his bunny. You know, I got him that bunny outfit. I may do that for his bunny, little bunny outfit. Because this has got bunnies on it. This one is a yellow with a white ring. Uh, and it's white around the pacifier. And it's got little bees on it. Little honeybees. So I got that today up there. And like I told you, I was wanting to do him a, a bottle. Well, I went to Walmart today, and I really wanted the Tommy Tippies, but they had them just with the white, um, you know, right, white rings around them. And I wanted his them with a blue. Well, they didn't have any Tommy Tippies with the blue, just the white with the Walmart I went. And I'm going to look again when I go to the, another Walmart and see. But anyway, I wound up getting this Nook one. I hope it works as good. I thought it was really cute. It's got the cover that goes on it. And then um, it's a blue ring around it. And this is what I like. It's this big squishy part. And see, when you do that, we're going to seal the bottle, the nipple. And when you do that, see, you push that in. And that's how you role play feeding your baby. Got to put it like that. But anyway, I've got my caulking. I mean, my silicone, rather. i got to seal the holes in it. And I don't know where it's got an air vent. I think that's an air vent right there on it. It'll have to be sealed. And then also up here, too. But it was different. It was a nook one. And it's got the blue ring around it. And then it's got like a, a, a green owl with blue wings. And some green and light blue and dark blue mushrooms. And then on the uh, on around, you go around, it's got like a little blue porcupine. And on around from there, it's like a little focus in blue. And it says nook right above it. So I thought that was cute. Now, they did have some of the, the Tommy Tippies where I went today with the blue rings, but they were like the great, you know, the great big bottles, and I didn't want one of those. I want just a little small, small five ounce. So this is all I could find today. I'll look again. I'm going to another Walmart, not this week. Well, it'll be next weekend, next Saturday, and I'll look for a Tommy Tippy there. So I'm hoping that this is going to work. I hope it don't, and it's not one that's going to leak around the, the rim. We're going to try it and see. But anyhow, I got that today. Put that lid back on there. And then you got your little cover that goes over it. It's cute. I liked it. I just rather had the Tommy Tippies, but that's okay. Maybe this will work for me too. Now to, to seal it with, I got this uh, it's silicone, just a small tube. I just got a little small tube. I think that's a three ninety seven. It's just the hundred percent silicone. It's clear. If you're gonna seal these bottles, guys, I always look, make sure you don't make sure it's got clear. Or, you know, it's not going to work. Now, of course, I've never done a, a fake bottle. This is my my first time, too. But I wanted him a fake bottle. And I may I may get him a couple more with Tommy Tippies. But anyway, this is that's the silicone to seal the end of the nipple. And what I'm going to do is, is instead of like squirting that nipple full, because I want the milk to pretty much, well, really, it don't have to. I start to say all the way to the end, but it really don't have to, because you're going to mash that in anyway. So, anyway, that's what that is. And then to, for the, the milk, I got, I was looking online at some of the people making the bo baby bottles, and they said to get the fabric softener. And I got the Ultra Downy Free and Gentle. It's white. It's not blue like the other Downy. It's white. And so they said, and I was going to get a real small bottle of it because that's all I was really needing because I've got regular Downy in there I use on my clothes. It's the blue Downy, you know, April Fresh, I think, or. Something like that. But, uh, I got this. I had to get the big one. This is all they had in the Walmart I was in. So I told my husband, I said, well, it won't be a waste because when I do that, I could just use what's left over on my clothes. You know, I always use down in my laundry. So this is just a free and clear. It's free of dyes and perfumes. So, you know, this will this will be okay. I don't know how it smells. I haven't even smelled it. Let me smell it. It don't. They say it don't have a smell. It don't have much of one. No, it's not got any perfumes in it, supposedly. But anyway, I got that. And then they say put a little bit of vanilla, which I got. This was the cheapest. I got it at Walmart. It was imitation vanilla flavoring. You just want it for color. A little bit of color. So, from what I'm seeing online is you pour about 
two ounces of this in the bottle, and then you add about two ounces of water, and I've used bottled water. Uh, and then you put just a little bit, not much, of this in it to give it a little bit of color to make it look like the formula. Now, I've never made it. We're going to try it, and I might just, I might film that. You know, I might video that and put it on here and let you guys see it. Uh, I may go ahead and do that because... I've never done it either, so, you know, it'll be trial and error together. We'll learn together, because I've never done it either, but I want him a bottle. But next week, I'm going to probably, I'm going to go to a different Walmart next week. So, I will probably get a, instead of the nut, I'll do, I'll keep this one, of course, because I like it. It's pretty, but I might get a Tommy Tippy, too. I'd like to have a Tommy Tippy. I like those. I think they're cute. But, anyway, that's what I got for today. Now, I hope I don't knock you guys off here. I'm going to take you down off the stand. I hope I don't cut you off. No, I got it. Okay. I'm going to take you around. I want, to, I want you guys to see what I got in the thrift store today. Look at this. I found this in a thrift, thrift store. Excuse me. Maybe I can get it back far enough to y'all can see it. Hang on. Bear with me. There it is. I found me a rocking chair in a thrift store today. It's a gold color. And it's like a gold. And it's, I'm pretty sure it's like the old antique. Antique ones. Look at the high back on it. It looks like an old antique type thing to me. But, you know, it is so clean. And it is my rocking chair I got for my baby. So when I get him fixed, I can rock him. And I'll have him a bottle and I can feed him. And rock him to sleep and all that. But I got that at a thrift store. You're not going to believe this, guys, today. I bought this. And it's great. It looks brand new. There's nothing on it anywhere else. Really pretty. I got that for $40 today in a thrift, in a thrift store. Uh, Habitat for Humanity store. And it, I think what she's telling me, the Habitat for Humanity, you know, they build houses for the uh, poorer people that can't, you know, that don't have a home and can't afford one or whatever. They're like homeless. And she said the there's, I guess, just like their section or maybe the whole outfit, I don't know. But they're going to try to build four houses this year for people. So that's where we got this was a it's a habit a habitat for humanity it's like a thrift store and they sell all this stuff and then the money they make from it goes into helping poor people with their houses you know the homeless and uh but this was just such a find and so i finally found me a small my room's so little on her guys <laughs> i told my husband we brought in sit down and i says i don't know where i'm going to put this i said but i want it but i said i just don't have i don't know where i'm going to put it but I'm going to have to find somewhere to put it. But uh, see, my room, and I've gotten here, it's a small little room anyway, and I work in here too. I've got like my tables where I paint and all that stuff. I told him, I said, I wish I had another place to like paint, you know, and, and do my work. Hmm. Can't get that to go over. <laughs> What's wrong with it? But I said to where I can, uh, you know, instead of uh, painting in here, this could I could just fix this up in here like my nursery. And then I'd have my, my workstation in a different place. But the only place I'd have to do that would be out like in the garage to do my painting and stuff. And who knows, you know, I may may switch my painting and all that. Uh, my workspace, I may switch it to out there. And just make this into my complete nursery because I don't know where I'm going to put my rocker. I told him I've got my sewing machine cabinet right behind that. I may have to move that out and put that out in the garage, my sewing mas machines and my sewing machine cabinet. And I uh, have a, you know, to have a place for the rocker and put it right there in that little space. But anyway, it's a work in progress. I've got this whole room packed full and don't know where I'm going to put anything. But I'll figure something out. <laughs> I may just have to take out my sewing machine cabinet back there and my sewing machines, like I said, and put them out and fix a place out there for them in the garage and keep those out there. Because I just don't have enough room in here. I, I, like I told you, I've got... I got my two work tables in here. That's what I paint from. And I wish I could get all that moved out to the garage. And then that way I just have this in here in nursery. But anyway, guys, that's all I got for today. Uh, I thought I'd hop on, say hello to everyone. It's late, uh, but we've just had a busy day. And I'm just now getting around doing a video. Uh, we've been out loafing a lot today. Like I told you, went to Murphy up to the Walmart, Murphy, North Carolina. No, we didn't. I'm sorry to tell you a lie. We went to Blue Ridge today, Blue Ridge, Georgia. We went to the Walmart. We stopped by Papa's Pizza and got us pizza for supper. And uh, I had him to run me by the thrift store. I'd, I'd been asking some of the online yard sales about a glider 
rocker. I found a lady that was going to sell me one and was supposed to let me get it. And uh, she back, she sold it out from under me to somebody else. After she'd already told me I could have it and couldn't pick it up Saturday, then she had sold it out from under me. So that was pretty dirty. And so while we were out, I seen this, uh, I saw that ha he Habitat for Humanity store there in Blue Ridge. And I told my husband as we come, had to go to Ace Hardware while we were there. And I seen this and I said, stop me by there just a minute, let me look. I said, you know, they probably don't have nothing like that. But I said, I'll, I'll look just to be sure. Gosh, you wouldn't believe the furniture they've got in there. Uh, but I found me this, and I can't have nothing real, real big in here. It's got to be a smaller type thing because the room's so small. I can't have like a big lazy boy rocker recliner or anything like that. It's just, there's not enough space. So I found this one. It's a smaller one. It's it's not real big at all. And it's it's the gold color. So it's going to go in any color of decor. I, I just was really happy. I thought it was a good find. It's really clean and great shape. So I thought it was such a find. So I got that today. But anyway, just thought I'd pop in and let you guys see this stuff I got and Say hello, happy Saturday, what's left of it, to everybody out there. And so I'll be doing another one put on tomorrow. But anyway, guys, as always, I appreciate you watching. And I will talk to you in a video soon. Oh, and don't forget to like and subscribe and please share this. So we can get those subscribers we need to give away that baby. Alright, guys, talk to you soon in another video. Bye-bye.